Hey everybody, the Bond guest back. Welcome to part 20 of Let's Play Final Fantasy X. Alright, we were still in Guado Salam, you know, just after uh, Seymour proposed to Yuna. So I wonder what her decision is going to be. Also, before we get started, I did notice something different about the Brotherhood Sword. Now, this might have been triggered just by going to the Far Plane, you know, when Waka was talking to Chapu about the sword that he had. Look at Brotherhood now. These stat changes or abilities actually got changed. Right now, my strength goes up to 15% with Water Strike and Sensor. How about that? That is a straight upgrade. We leave as soon as Yuna returns. I trust you'll be ready. Why wouldn't I? For a while there, I was a little worried about what was going to happen, yeah? Huh? Like, what do you mean exactly? Listen, if Yuna gets married, then I... What? That again? Yes. If she is to marry, I would want her to marry for love. See? But, if Yuna said she wanted to marry the one she loves, I would have to object. Huh? Uh, you're not making much sense. I know. And you're okay with that? Lulu? I've talked enough about that. What? I'm sorry, just forget about it. Jeez, Grumpy. You'll understand one of these days. I just don't want to give it words, not yet. I shouldn't have to say this, but don't fall in love with her. Um, okay. That's fine then. I don't know what exactly would happen like later on in the game based on what decision you make, but for a while I there, I was... I'm a little worried about Lord Jiskal. I wonder if Maester Seymour has heard. Maybe he will. We leave as soon as Yuna returns. I trust you'll be ready. And I cannot go in the house. All right, so what are we waiting on? My, was the Lady Summoner not with you? No, she's at Seymour's place. That's Maester Seymour, or Lord Seymour. Oh, I'll be careful. Sorry. That's all right. Oh, Maester Seymour left Guado Salam a short while ago. You serious? I believe he went to the temple in Makalania. Maester Seymour is also the high priest of that temple. Whoa, I gotta tell the others. And where did you wanna go? Was she in the house the whole time? Lord Jisco, please tell me. What can I do to help? Yuna, let's go! They say Seymour went to Makarena Temple. Makalania Temple. I? What I don't get is, why would the Lord Maester head off without a peep to anyone? Maybe he wasn't expecting Yuna's answer so soon. Ah, that's probably it. <laughs> Yuna, what is it? Oh, nothing. Hmm. You're a poor liar. It's true, it's nothing. Come on, let's go. Ah, uh, no sense trying to pry it out of her. <laughs> Anyway, I guess we gotta go this way to Makalania. Which means go through the Thunder Plains, and we should be able to get there. And then at least to Makalania Woods. Alright, so we got a couple places before we reach the next temple. Oh no! We're here! Ah! 
How are we supposed to cross that? See the lightning rod towers? The lightning is drawn to them, hopefully. We head north, not too near and not too far from the towers, yeah? Meaning we should avoid wide open areas. <gasps> I think I forgot something in Guado Salam. Nice knowing you. Okay, okay, I'll go. Moving across the Thunder Plains, Lightning can strike Tidus on the Gandalf Thunder Plains. Lightning can strike at any time, so keep moving. The Lightning Rod Towers absorb nearby Lightning. Seek shelter under them. When there are no towers nearby, you can dodge Lightning by pressing X. Hit X as soon as you see a Lightning Flash. If successful, you can dodge the Thunderbolt. Yeah, there's a particular item you can get that will help later on, but you have to dodge lightning 200 times in a row. Yes, that infamous quest. Constantly mashing X, however, can be dangerous. Good luck on your journey. And it plays that kind of music, that's hilarious. And I messed up. On the very first one. <laughs> well, the good news is lightning does not do any damage to you. You'll just fall flat on your face. And yeah, believe it or not, you do fight enemies even in this. You got a Melusine, a, a Kusari Kuru, and an Air Rouge. Lots of different foes. Good luck with that. <laughs> Oh yeah, and they definitely like to use lightning spells. Which should be pretty obvious, given where we are. Now the good news is that pretty much every enemy that is weak against water, so use that to your advantage. Miss! Very nimble. Yeah, that's what I did. That's why I had Tidus take it on. Alright, so use water on that. Oh, it's actually weak against ice. Alright, so it's not water. Yeah. Got it. Now I heard there- oh my god. Now I heard there is a way you can like disable encounters. I think it's an auto ability. So it would be a good idea to probably wait until you got that before you even think about trying to dodge lightning 200 times. Because you will get into fights even in here. And that can really disrupt your flow. Larva? Oh, that's gonna be a toughie. Hey, Waka, you wanna take Sit this one? Sit back and watch. I'll deal with these butt punches. Any way we can. This is for the fallen! Nice! That took care of that one. Uh, probably go with Watera for this one. Considering it had a lot of HP. And it's still not dead. Now it's dead. You definitely don't want that thing growing on ya. Alright, so let's get some levels applied. Ah, oh, Oron can't get anything. Uh, Waka can. And there we go. That's all she wrote. What's up with that light over there? I'm gonna go check that out. Good to know that Lulu is also nimble. When it matters most. It's kind of 
aware that the Melusine is the only enemy you can't really damage highly with water. Uh, since I can petrify and only has soft. Oh, come on! Are you kidding me? Like, what is Tinas' accuracy, anyway? Let's find out. The first. Okay. I guess I'm just going this way so I can get stuff for Lulu. So yeah, we might as well use that spear. We have eight left now. Okay, accuracy is only 14. I don't know if that's dangerously low or anything. I don't think it is. Now, should I bother even going this way? I guess I could. Yeah, let's, like, retreat and use another spear. <laughs> I don't know how many more spears you need to get before you unlock all the nodes. Oh my god! What is that supposed to be? A strange stone. Huh. Alright. just there for the sake of being there. Like, seriously, what, what is even the point of that? <laughs> you just keep running to such bad luck. Also, Aura needs to be healed. And he's petrified. Good job. I'll let Yuna take this one. Just to make sure that Horn will still get experience. I suppose he still will, even if he's petrified. If I were to guess. Let me break the ice. Hey, now Yuna gets some experience. First, Orin pretty much hits the jackpot. Freeze magic, which doesn't matter. Freeze magic, which also doesn't matter. Freeze accuracy, which kind of matters. Now for Yuna, we gotta send you down here. Let's get you more MP, right? Good. Because you really need that to do more healing. Hi, what are you doing well, here? Well, hello there. Would you like to hear about this place? Sure. Very well. Let me tell you about the crossing. A long time ago, this place was a traveler's nightmare. Plains of lightning, plains of thunder. Those who cross are torn asunder. Or so they used to say. Then, a man by the name of Bilgen appeared. Using Machina, he built towers that served as lightning rods across the plains. Finally, travelers were able to cross in safety. Bilgen was building that tower over there. When he was struck and killed by lightning. Oh, sucks to be in then. Also, I should go back to that statue, because I did see what looked like a cactus symbol. I wonder if I can do anything with it. A lunar curtain? I wonder if that's a rare item. Anyway, it's good to get one. Gold element? Uh, maybe I should use Watera. I don't know if it has way more HP than the other ones. Well, it's probably about the same. Ha! 
Let's just take this thing down to size. And I think that should be it? No, I think I might just use regular water. Got it. What does a Lunar Curtain even do? I want to take a look. Cash Shell on one character. And while I was like grinding outside of Guada Salam, some enemies can drop, or rather you can steal from them, Stamina Tablets, or Hypello Potions. So I guess they would be good for making abilities out of them. What if I just press square? Fudge! And now I get ambushed! Oh my lord. We're getting bamboozled here. We got like two turns in a row. God damn it. Oh, there's a new enemy. It's a viewer. Watch out for confusion. That's just what we need. Besides, Lulu's almost dead. We gotta bring Walk out. You called? Why do you have to say it like that? Sounds kind of creepy. Oh yeah, 1200 HP, yikes. That's a lot. It looks like only Lulu can hit them, unless... Oh, never mind, Waka can as well. Or maybe we just got really lucky that time. Alright, can I finally look at that stone statue? Without getting bamboozled by lightning. And get a fight soon after. Alright, let's get ourselves healed up. Oh, wait a minute, there's a chest over there. Wait, something's happening. I don't know if that's good. What was that? Didn't do anything. Oh my god! I have dodged zero lightning bolts. Whoa! What? The hell? Needles! I hate needles! Cactuar with a Q. And you can get a chocobo feather from them. That's pretty cool. Okay, good to know that the uh, capture card feed still stayed because the TV just disappeared. Only for like a second. Let's try fire. Waka, you might be able to beat this thing. Damn! I'm good, yeah? Get destroyed! First goal. Alright, so it's a new weapon for Waka. Is it any good? Initiative. Okay, so I guess I make sure that we don't get like an get ambushed or anything. It's too bad it only has one slot. Like I would have been tempted to use it. But in any case, at least we got his agility up. And Riku, you could use more defense. All right, let's go. I'm lucky I might dodge the lightning once. Huh. Or get ambushed. Because it's just my lucky day.
Oh my lord. It's just nothing but lightning spells all the time. Just grab an electro marble. I hope it's any any useful. Oh my god. It's just nothing but thunder and thundara. Our characters don't exactly have tons of magic defense, I'm just saying. Constantly had to rely on Yuna to keep us alive. I mean, she's pulling her weight, I'll say that much. I know we bought some yellow equipment. I don't know if I just want to equip it right now. Some of us already got it on, at least. Raise defense by four points! I'm still getting hit by lightning. Hi. Good day. Hi there. Is it true? I heard that Maester Seymour and Lady Yuna are to be wed. It's such great news. I have to tell everyone. Where'd you hear that? From the Guado. They were all very excited. Huh. I'm afraid you heard a little wrong. Yuna's gonna turn him down. <gasps> oh, really? Uh, yep, no wedding. I see. That's unfortunate. Well, I'm sure that people would have rejoiced all over Spira. Oh. Where was the rest of my party? Like, weren't they not listening in on this? They couldn't just say, like, a uh, Titus, what the hell are you talking about? Like, are you spreading slander again? Cut that out right now. Also, they really need to leave Lulu alone. Just a couple of hits and she's nearly dead. I feel like for the Melusine, Mel Melusine is that I should just be using Waka for this. Like, he's pulling his weight more in that situation. And trust me, you really need someone to pull their weight. In a place like this. There's a little suspicious alcove over there. I want to check that out. Oh wow, a preemptive strike in our favor? I didn't know those existed anymore. Back quite a few ambushes. And you know, maybe just regular attacks. But hardly anything that benefited us. Enough. That's how it's done. Good on you, Oran, to like teach these guys a lesson. Oh my god! Fucking God. <laughs> I have dodged zero lightning bolts. Like, I press X as soon as I see the flash, then nothing happens. Also, why'd I go that way? That's a dead end. Yeah, because I can't use anything right now. I have to go back this way. That's better. At least for him. Oh my god, Yuna. Once you get Kira, you'll be a lot more valuable to the team. A water ball? Okay, let's give that to Waka. I'll stick it on him for now. Even though I did like the other one better. A strange stone. Just another one of those things. Alright, so next fight's probably gonna be another one of those cactuars. Or not! 
It just happened to be something else completely. I guess we'll stick around. Waka can deal with a couple of these. Oh, I really hoped you would get lucky with that one. Apparently not. Alright, so Waka ended up being the hero of this mission, or this battle. I pressed X! Alright, there's a tower. To save me from myself. Just get rid of that thing, seriously. It was becoming a nuisance. I'm surprised Lulu still has enough MP. Constantly casting spells. Including Blizzara and Watera sometimes, or Watera. And now she gets another level up for her uh, troubles. I was concerned about her health. At least getting that will be a, a great deal. How long is this plane anyway? Oh, there's the butt munch. Alright, let me use somebody that also has an overdrive. Titus, you actually no. I should let Riku steal another chocobo feather. Thousand needles! Yikes! Um... I guess we'll try Fury. I don't know what its overall weakness is, so I'm just gonna take a shot in the dark. Well, that definitely didn't work. <laughs> Do you? I just need you not to miss. So apparently this guy's got really good evasion, but in very high magic defense. Check this out. Oh, we got a Cactuar Spy! What the hell is that? Well, it's for Lulu, so let's see what it's all about. Oh, it also has initiative. I mean, it's alright, I guess. I have two weapons that can do that. But overall, I think I'm just better off moving on. Whoa! Whoa! That was a close one! <laughs> Stop kidding around. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> mm, what's wrong? <laughs> You're giving me the creeps! Whoa! I want to go home. I hate lightning. I hate thunder. Let's go rest over there, please. This storm never stops. Better to cross quickly. I know, but just for a little while. <laughs> well, what now? <sighs> Pretty please? Just a few minutes. I'm scared of lightning. Let's rest, please. Pretty please. Oh yeah, whatever. I'm too young to die. That is so hilarious. Sorry, minority rules. I'm a little tired. Do you have a room available? Ah, Lady Summoner. Yes. 
just over that way. Thank you. Uh, Yuna? It's not like her. Welcome to Rin Travel Agency. They have a wide selection, blah blah blah. Or well, at least all this stuff's at a good value. Also, why would I need a world map if I already got one? I can buy some grenades. I'll buy five. Ah, let's see, what else should we do? Are you that scared? <laughs> when I was little, a fiend attacked me while I was swimming at the beach. My brother tried to beat it back with a spell. spell ouch I've been scared of lightning ever since but it can be effective magic is effective against marine fiends my brother said that too you should learn some spells too ah! hmm maybe later Nice to see you again. Welcome to the Rin Travel Agency. Oh. Shh. Hmm. How goes your study of our language? Uh, it's okay. That is good to hear. Allow me to present you with this book for your study. Oh, that's volume number 14. All right, H now becomes N. I wonder, would that be Sir Orin by any chance? Uh, yeah, that's him. Ah, as I thought. I've been wondering since I saw him at the Meehan High Road branch. Sir Orin, I wonder if you remember me. Ten years ago, at the beginning of Lord Braska's calm, Yes, I should thank you. Not at all. I could not leave a wounded man to die. However, I was surprised when I saw you gone the next morning with that wound. An ordinary man would not have been able to walk. I'd rather drop that subject, Rin. As you wish. Yeah, he's no ordinary man either. You not resting. Go away. Wow, that's rude. <laughs> it's not easy being a guardian to a summoner so young. Yeah, you think? Yuna looked preoccupied. Was it because of Jiskel? Oh, she never told me. I wonder what's wrong with Yuna. Well, let me go find out. Nothing really. I I just uh, um uh, 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 I I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have uh, come in. Uh, 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 hey, wasn't that that uh, just called Guado guy? The sphere is his will. It says, take care of my son. No, I said other things too. Huh. His son, Seymour? Well, I know one way to take care of him. I'm sorry. Huh? Ah, 
What do you think you're up to? You know, you know was acting funny. Yeah, so, so. yeah. She'll tell us when she's ready, so hold your chocobos till then. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. Well, I'm surprised I don't need a neck brace. Whatever happens, we're still Yuna's guardians. Then let's just go on with the journey, huh? Oh, better walk I get me than this guy. No, I don't want to talk, okay. We're not through the Thunder Plains yet, so be prepared, all right? Oh yeah, apparently there's more. It's not stopping, is it? Don't tell me you were hoping it would. Ah! Fine, stay here. All right already. But you didn't have to say it like that, you know. That's just who he you is. You could Relax. be more comforting or something. You know, try to cheer me up. You just don't get me at all, do you? Hey, are you listening? <gasps> I'm not scared! I'm not scared, you hear? She's scared. <laughs> What was that all about? Did he drop something? A yellow shield? Why did he drop a yellow shield? Well, at least I do have an opportunity to train if I need to. And it looks like that might be a good idea considering how tough these enemies can be. Well, in any case, let's save, because we haven't done that in a while. Well, not since the other side of the south part of the plains. <laughs> Alright, so next episode, we will go to the other side of the Thunder Plains. See everyone, thanks for watching.